gotta catch them all. Ah, I see we have to create myself in this lovely video game. This is something new I've never had to do in a Pokemon game. <laughs> Instead of spending 10 hours on the character creator, I'll use the power of YouTube editing to... Oh, look at me! I'm reading a book! And now I have to get up from reading my book! Alright, we're getting up. What do we gotta do? Do I grab my running shoes and go to Viridian City to get a map? Of course not. I'm in Paldea. Oh, but there's a backpack here, and I'm a school student, so... Your bag and hat are hanging here, but it's not time to get ready yet. Okay. What do I do? Do I tell my mom in the kitchen oh, I'm ready to go on a Pokemon adventure? Do I visit Oak's lab? Muncha. No, I run into a squirrel. Okay. Squirrel. Hi. You know, they eat those where I'm from. Muncha. Don't get too close. You look delicious. Good morning, Rose. Oh, already in your uniform and everything. Well, it's your first day of school, all after all. I'm so excited for you. So you might want to play your... So you might want to cool your engines before you go racing out the door. The school contacted me and said you're supposed to wait here a little longer. Their words, not mine. 
Apparently there's something very important for your first day that still hasn't arrived. Maybe that's the very thing we're waiting for. Rose, get the door, would you? Muncha. Muncha. Do forgive the intrusion. You are Master Rose, yes? On behalf of the Academy, I apologize for the late arrival of your enrollment documents. Ah, and also for my delay in introducing myself. I am director of the Daraja Academy. You may call me Clavel. The director, you came here on the way in person to help my son with his first day? Well, I am responsible for the entire Academy, including any pa failures on his part. So here at last are the enrollment documents that should have already been delivered to you. Goodness, you really needn't have. Since you come all this way, at least I can offer you a cup of tea. No need to trouble yourself. Rose, I've got a thing to discuss the director here. Why don't you head back up to your room and finish getting ready for school? You'll need your bag and your hat as well. Now, Mr. Clavel, you must simply join me for a cuppa. This way. Well, how can I refuse such a kind offer? A cuppa. Well, they get it half right, because my dad is Australian and he speaks like that all the time. I have never heard my mother say cuppa. A cup of tea. Cup of pop 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 All right, I got my backpack. I'm on my way to school to become a Pokemon trainer, apparently. What happened to the wilderness and going out adventuring at 10 years old? Getting a Pokedex from an old man who probably wants to blow your mother. Oh, you kids are so babied now. You have to go to school. You can press the X button to open the main menu and select the save option from the menu. Cool. Good to know. I know how to save a game. Look. I can save. Oh. I saved my progress. There we go. We've done it. See, I'm a master at tutorials. Oh, just look at you. All ready for your big day? Yes, the uniform of our storied academic... Wait, no, I'm sorry. Yes, the uniform of our storied academy suits you quite well indeed. Academy, I know, I... I, I, I... Yes, the uniform of our storied academy suits you quite well indeed. Sir, I am wearing a dress shirt and swimming trunks. Your region is weird. Oh gracious, how very careless of me. I had entirely forgotten that I have something else for you, Master Rose, the most important thing. But your living room is hardly the place for it. Would you care to follow me outside? I wonder what this important thing might be. Let's follow the director and see what he has to say, shall we? Right then, dear Pokemon, time to come out of your Pokeballs. Oh my god, I love you, Coco. Look at that face. That big goofy idiot face. I love him. You got the cat, the croc, and the duck. And the gator's just like the crocodile's just like I'll ask you to choose which among these three you'd like it to have as your partner. Spragato, the grass cat Pokemon. Foy Coco the Fire Croc Pokemon. And Quaxly the Duckling Pokemon. They're all very good company. Why they usually refuse to even leave my side. What's this? Hmm, so it, it turns out they're more interested in you, Master Rose, than familiar old me. 
I do wish they could stay and see which one you'll choose, but we I must be off to my next home visit. I'll be at the house just over there. Take your time with your decisions and come find me once you've made up your mind. Come on. Rude duck swimming in somebody's pond. Garden cat digging holes and sniffing flowers. Or, ooh, look, I got you an apple. I cooked you an apple. Are these the these da, da, da. are these three the trainers? Not quite. Master Rose is yet to make his choice. You see. I made you an apple, but I burnt it. Have you decided which of these Pokemon you, would you like to be your first partner? Come on. He tried to cook me an apple. It's obvious. Cra! That's Fue Coco, a fire type. The burning hut sparks. It scatters, will fry any plant uh, in a flash. Would you like to go with our good fire type Pokemon Fue Coco here? Yes. You choose Fui Coco. You want to give Fui Coco a nickname? Nah. Maybe later. It's Fui Coco. Hot Coco. <laughs> it could be Hot Coco. Get it? Fui Coco. He's a fire. His name's Coco. Hot Coco. It's perfect. Rose, I can't believe you actually chose Fui Coco. I mean, like, the way to make the perfect choice for you. You two make such a good combo. Can I choose one of these Pokemon too, Director Clavel? Oh, but didn't you receive a Pokemon when you entered the Academy, Mr. Mona? Not back then, no, I had other Pokemon. Uh, not back then, no, I had other Pokemon I was focused on raising at the time. But now I want to raise a Pokemon alongside Rose while he raises his own new partner. Indeed, a rather splendid idea. If you wish to raise one of these Pokemon on equal footing with Master Rose, here I shall be more than happy to allow it. Why are they calling me Master Rose? I am Master Rose now. Once that changing the Paladin and the White out of my name, just going Master Rose. Since Rose chose Fue Coco, I'll go for this little one. Nice to meet you, Sprigato. Welcome to the team. All right, then. Now that we've chosen our Pokemon, we have to battle. I'll be waiting for you down at the beach. Come join me when you're ready. As you may have noticed, Miss Nimona is a tad overly fond of Pokemon battling, but I do hope you're joining her for a battle. It will help you get to know your Pokemon as well. Ah, she chose a grass type. I don't know why my rivals are choosing Pokemon that are opposite of mine now. Like, back in my day, you had a challenge. Gary mother- We got you! Chose Squirtle when I chose Charmander. Anyone could be a Pokemon trainer as long as they have Pokemon by their side. And it's our duty as trainers to help our Pokemon grow strong through battle. So you ready to battle, Rose? Sure, why not? Perfecto! I'm so excited. For this battle, I think I'll use... Miss Mona. I trust you remember that Master Rose is wholly inexperienced to Pokemon training? I'm sorry. What? Show you the face of God. Whoops, good call, Director. I was about to send one of my usual partners right off the bat. I guess I'll take this chance to try out my new buddy instead. Come on, Rose, let's have a fruitful battle.
I know that's the first battle, so let's just have some fun. Pika Pika, Pika Pikachu. Wow, not bad, neighbor. I beat up my neighbor for 300. That does not sound right. Look at you winning your first battle ever. You've gotten even more potential than I thought. You're gonna be a strong trainer for sure. But now I want to try a new st no, but now I want to try a different strategy. Let's go again. Just one more battle. All right, one sec. I'm gonna go break out a kiss. <laughs> Master Rose and his boy Coco are surely weary after all. <laughs> Master Rose and his boy Coco are surely weary already from that last battle. Ah, sorry. I kind of got caught up in the, in the excitement. I'm really sorry, Rose. Same to your poor Coco too. Oh, definitely. We'll I'll de we'll definitely be battling some more. Your team two seem to be coming friends fair fast. Though you've just met. Can I count on you to take your new schoolmate here under your wing, Mr. Mona? I'm sure you can learn a great deal from a champion ring trainer like yourself. You bet, sir. Oh, that reminds me. Since you're new to training Pokemon, there's an app you'll definitely need. You have a smartphone, right? Let me see it for a second. The Pokedex app was added to your bottom phone. The Pokedex will automatically register and see Pokemon you catch. It's a must have for Pokemon trainers. It's a super handy app. Our homeroom teacher, Mr. Jack, actually made it himself. You sit on a throne of lies. Back in my day, we used ordinary paper and handwritten notes to compile our Pokedexes. It's quite the age we live in now. Oof, filing, uh, oof, filling out a Pokedex by hand? I can't even imagine how much work it would be. Oh, no, 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 I suppose you can't. Yet, no matter how much the times may change, the wonder of meeting new Pokemon never does. That is truly a timeless pleasure. And the more Pokemon you encounter, the, the more you'll find yourself growing and changing. I hope you will both work hard towards the goal of completing your own Pokedexes. Now, Mr. Mona, I do still have a few matters to discuss with your parents. Could I depend on you to see Master Rose to the Academy? You'd be doing me quite the favor. Of course, leave it to me, and then I leave him in your capable hands. All right, then. All right, little one, it's time for you and I. We're on our way. Oomph. Oomph. <clears throat> Maybe I ought to make a a little more time to work on my Pokedex along with my battling. Oh, right. Speaking of Pokedexes, Rose, you've probably never caught a wild Pokemon, right? I'll show you the ropes before I take you to the Academy. Come join me. You can go places. Cool. All right. Let's move on now. Like, I did play some of the Alola games, so I, I, I do get it. I do understand quite a bit. But there's still a lot of changes that have happened. Oh, Rose, I hear Nimona here will be taking you to school. That's right, ma'am, leave him to me. So you already managed to make yourself a friend. Wait, no, wait, no, wait, 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 no, 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 no. The neighbor girl is talking to my mom already. And I read all about these wonderful teachers you have looking after you at the school. Plus, he has so many f handy facilities you can use as much as you like. And in your new friend, Nimona, it sounds like you have the your school life is shaping up to be fantastic. Now you'll be staying in the school dorm, so I want you to promise me you'll eat proper meals. Here's a bit of spending money to start off your day. I have packed you a lunch for your first day. You obtained sandwich from mom. Yes. I got a sandwich from mom. And maybe you'd better take these too. Up you obtain five potions. Put the potions in the potion bag. Thank you, mom, for the potions. Use them on the precious little partner of yours should you get hurt in battle. I know every day in your new life is going to be full of exciting experiences far from home. Just try to savor all the good times and the hard times too. But if you ever want to come back home, you know your bed is always ready for you. 
All right then. You two better head off, I suppose. Take care on the way to school. Your mother's so nice, Rose. Oh, but I was going to teach you how to catch wild Pokemon. Come on, Vamoose. I'm getting girl next door vibes, and I'm not sure how I feel about this. All right, this here is the Poco Path. It's a path that leads to adventure for you and me. Out here, things are different than in town. Are you gonna see wild Pokemon out and about? They'll be on the path and in the grass and such. Get you close and you'll have to battle, but you got Foy Coco for that, right? And if you want to try to catch a Pokemon, you gotta use a good old Pokeball. I've got tons, have a few. You obtain five Pokeballs. You put the Pokeball in your Pokeball bag. There's a pig. I have a ball. I'm gonna throw the ball at the pig. Oh, what luck. Time for some learning by doing. Try battling Lachunk, Rose. Lachunk. Lachunk, chunk, 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 chunk. That is my Fue Coco. That is a Lachunk. And no moves. Okay, let's need to how they have that. But I'm just gonna throw a Pokeball. Gotcha, a little chunk was caught. Lachunk's data has been registered to the Pokedex. Searched for food all day, it possesses a keen sense of smell, but doesn't use it for anything other than foraging. Oh, do I want to nickname that? No, I don't want to nickname Lachunk. Lachunk has been added to your party. Hala! That was awesome. You caught the very first Pokemon you went for. I'm crummy when it comes to actually catching Pokemon. Maybe you should give me tips. Anyway, here, I have some more Pokeballs just in case not every catch works out. You put the Pokeballs into your bag's po Pokeball pocket. We get the Pokemon, then throw the Pokeball. Remember that and you'll be fine. Now go battle those wild Pokemon and catch some of them. Let's meet back up at the lighthouse over there. You can see our school from the top. Okay. I'll show you how to catch a Pokemon. Now that we've weakened it, we gotta throw the Pokeball. <laughs> Pull me. Get to the set. Like, I, wa I want to get to know the types first before I build any, like, solid teams yet. Because I have a feeling this team will probably have to carry me through the game for a bit. Hey, Rose, you getting a uh, hang of how to catch Pokemon, okay? Let me see how much you've caught so far. Whoa, what was that? I've never heard that kind of cry before. Could it be something strong? Pokemon or something? I say we find whatever made that cry. Let's take a look around, Rose. Just be careful. There's a kind of unsafe cave not too far from here, so stay clear. And I know your rod and phone can help keep you safe, but watch your step by the cliffs. Wait, my rod and phone can keep me safe? How does that work?
I'm gonna say that's pretty OP. Oh, what's wrong, fella? Hungry? Why wait? Grab a sandwich. Mysterious Pokemon seems to be too weak to move. Maybe you can give it something to help perk it up. Hungry? Why wait? Give it a sandwich. Hey, you go, little guy. You look so hungry. Have my mom's sandwich. She put pickles on it, and I hate pickles. You look like a Pokemon who likes pickles, right? Right. You're all happy now? Say he likes pickles. He does not find pickles at all. I'm oh, sorry, I hate the hat I have on. Wait up, friend! I thought we could hang out and talk about how much I hate pickles and how much you like pickles! Come back, friend! Let's talk about how much we hate pickles! And how much I hate pickles, and how much you like pickles! We are like the perfect team! You will eat all the pickles off my burger, and I will eat the burger! You'll go that way, I'll go down here. I've had a Pokeball for you, friend! Now, now you can. Wait, no, no, Rose. What? What? We're talking about pickles down here. There you are, Rose. Are you okay? You're not hurt, right? I'm fine. I'm fine. We're talking about pickles. My goodness, I was really worried. If you had gotten hurt because I said we should go looking for whatever made that cry. No, never mind that. Right now, we've got to focus on getting you back up here. You've got to, you've just got to find some way to climb out of there. If you get close enough, I'll try pulling you up with one of my Pokemon moves. Kind yeah, of seems like it's waiting for you. Does it want you to follow? Yeah, uh, we're, we're like, we're having this great conversation about pickles. Yeah, you think that guy up there likes pickles? Excuse me, sir. Do you like pickles? I hate pickles. Have you heard about our Lord and Savior, Shuckle? I mean, we got a fire, we got an electric. Should we try for the ground? Yeah, sure, let's try for a ground. I keep hitting the wrong button. I want to hit X. It's just, I've played on PlayStation so much. Diglett was caught.
Dig lit has been added to the Pokedex. It lives in oh, it lives about one yard on the ground where it feeds on plant roots. It sometimes appears above ground. I I don't want a young a uh, young lose or whatever. Diglett I was okay with because we can get a nice type advantage going on. Don't mess with the giant lizard thing. All right, I'll be right there. Just I found a shiny thing and I want to pick it up. Glad you've got a bodyguard, but watch your back. I mean. Hi, how you doing? Oh my gosh, it's straight up over as a rock. How powerful is it? I wonder what move that man is. Man, I want to stay over close. Rose, look out, something's coming. Behind you. It's behind you. Hi, mister. Do you like pickles too? I hate pickles. Do you want some of my pickles? I don't think he wants any of my pickles. I'm gonna catch it. Okay, I'm not gonna catch it. My Foy Coco just got pulverized. Tail Whip is super effective. Dooms. Hound doors. I'm getting manhandled by a giant lizard. Okay, two things we can take from this. One, the Pokemon understands English. Two, I got manhandled. Like, I am limp like a baby in this Pokemon's arms, okay? This is like the reverse of what happened to Ash and Pikachu. Way to go for a second. I thought you were both goners. Oh, what's wrong? Say you will need more pickles, friend. Maybe it used all of its, uh, maybe it used up all of its power. What is this Pokemon anyway? It looks kind of like a Sizzler, but never seen one quite like this before. And now it looks so different from a minute ago. You think it's okay? You can't tell either, huh, Rose? Well, all that aside, I'm seriously glad to have you back up here in one piece. You know that battle down there was really something. You and this fella look perfectly in sync facing down that Houndoom. What, you didn't even tell it what to do? I guess it's not like, I guess it's not like you're his, this Pokemon's trainer yet, huh? What's that friend? You smell pickles? Well, you better go get some. Oh good, it looks like it perked up a little. Do you think this fellow was one making that mysterious cry we heard before? I'm gonna say yes. Oh man, oh man, oh man. The more I look at this Pokemon, the more mysterious it seems. If you do become a trainer, you gotta let me battle against it. Let's just exchange numbers so we can get in touch if, uh, if we get separated again. And here, this will let you teach your Pokemon a move that will help it battle against stronger opponents. It's swift. It will not let me battle stronger opponents. 
You have a TM32 in the TM's bag. Cool. Think before using it though, TMs can only be used once. We've been, oh, we've both been through enough for a minute. I think we better take a breather. Let's just get to the lighthouse. That'll be a good plot to relax. I think somebody's there. Hello? Why that little? What are you doing out here? I'm not talking to you two. You can shove off. Rude. Wait, I know you. Aren't you Arvin? You're enrolled in the humanities track. And aren't you the son of that Pokemon researcher, Professor Seda? Doesn't matter who my mom is. The real issue is he. What? The real issue is what in the world is this Pokemon doing out here? And what is with the form it's in? So we heard the strange cry and we tried to investigate, but I kind of fell off a cliff. But I mean, you know? That Pokemon saved me, but it seemed kind of wore out itself in the process. It got kind of slumpy afterwards. But you should have seen it before. It looked totally different. It was unbelievably strong. Well, yeah, as it should be, but I can't fight while it's like this. The form Korodian takes in battle, that's its true form. Korodion? Is that this Pokemon's name? How do you know it? You can't go into the lab, it's locked. I don't remember ever seeing you around, but you could... I don't ever remember seeing you around, but given the uniform, you got to the academy too, don't you? Corridine isn't a sort of Pokemon that any old trainer can hope to command. It's special. Special how? What sort of Pokemon is it? You think you're up for ordering Corridine around? Then how about I test your worthiness? Huh, well look at you, quite the little go-getter. I've been feeling all out of sorts, so I'm gonna use this battle to blast these doldrums away. Please tell me he's not my rival. You're challenged by Pokemon Trainer Arvin. Boncho? Pika Pika! Pika Pikachu! Seems you know a thing or two about battling. Maybe? Just a little? Just a little? Just a little. Just a little. Just a little. Just saying. Well, Rose, that was awesome. I guess I wasn't even going to stand a chance using some Pokemon I had only just caught. But if you really think you can hear an old Corridion off, uh, but if you really think you can take Corridion off my hands for me, you'll need this. It's a Pokeball the Brute kept in. You obtained Cordine's Pokeball. You put Cordine's Pokeball in the bag and key items. So why'd you have it? Anyway, that's your problem now, not mine. Good luck. Well, oi, can you not hear me or something? Go, you got completely ignored. What a weirdo. The urban guy, he definitely knows more than he's letting on. Next time he and I are battling and I'm gonna roaring him some answers out of him. But, oh right, we gotta climb the lighthouse. Can't wait to show you the view of the school. I am getting girl next door vibes. Like she is like aggressive towards everybody else. And then when it's suddenly me, she's like, hi. Look at, like, look at me, I'm sweet and feminine. I also want to battle the hell out of you. Turns me on. Look, Rose, Megazoza. 
And that huge building with the Pokemon is our school. That's a big school in a castle. It's like a Hogwarts meets Yu-Gi-Oh! GX meets Pokemon. It'd be so great having you in the same class, Rose. Right, I can't wait to get back. We're gonna have... We're... <laughs> Right? Oh, I can't wait to get back. We're gonna get to learn so much and battle so, so, so much. Isn't it awesome you, what you can see from up here? Mountain forest, grasslands, beautiful nature stuff, as far as the eye can see. And you know what's waiting for you all over these natural spaces? Tons of Pokemon. Consider this me officially telling you walk into Paldea. But anyways, like you can see, it's kind of a hike to get to school from here. Let's make it to Los Platos for starters. That's right on the way. Vamos, come on. All right, we gotta go do the thing. Hey, let's battle. Okay. Talk to, uh, if you talk to a photo trainer like me, it means we're gonna battle. Oh, you sweet summer child. You were challenged by Youngster Alliance. Listen, 10 year olds get their drainage license. Why are you out? Like, kid, you gotta be upset telling your mom some guy beat up your Pokemon and stole your lunch money. Now, go tell your mom some guy beat you up and stole your lunch money. Lechonk learned disarming voice. Diglett learned growl. The Pokemon are strong, huh? Well, maybe a water type. We'll explore the region soon. And we'll try to get an idea of all the things we can catch. Build our team from there. That's a dog. If you can beat me, I'll tell you a cool secret. Hey, you five bucks is not a cool secret. You were challenged by Zahira the student. Okay, okay, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. If I am a student going to this prestigious guy, I mean, I'm like, I'm like 10 years, right? Like, he's a standard age for a Pokemon trainer, I would like to believe, right? Then, how is she enrolled? Does the Pokemon world have like a preschool? I'm gonna feel bad for this pig. Let me sing you the song of my people. I'll faint. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I lost, even though my Pokemon had full HP. And I beat up the kid and took her lunch money. Here's secret Pokemon Center for heal all your Pokemon for free. What do you mean? You already knew that? Can I kick this child? Wait, Rose, over here. This here is a Pokemon Center. You can come here to take a care of a lot of things related to your Pokemon. But I'll leave the explanation to the pros here. Happy to be of service, and welcome to the Pokemon Center. I'm here to keep everyone's Pokemon healthy. 
Here on my left is a Pokemon counter. You can buy things like Pokeballs and potions. Here we also accept both in cash and in league points. So that is one LP is worth one Pokebuck. And this to my right is the Techno Machine Machine. TM Machine for short. It's your ticket to making TMs, which you can use to teach moves to your Pokemon. You'll need to pay in League Points and supply the machine with materials that Pokemon drop. League Points come in handy both at the machines and at stores. I've got a lot. Here, have some. Oh yeah, and some of these too. We received a lot of materials from Nimona. And the Union Circle, you can connect with other trainers to find yourself some adventuring companions. Come visit us at the Pokemon Center anytime you need any help. We will, thanks. Remember, had a rough adventure? Go to... <laughs> Remember, had a rough adventure? Get to the Pokemon Center. Sometimes you have to know this sort of stuff for quizzes at school. But for Monix, help out. Here's another one. Are you ready? Then let's go. Goofy, sure, but it helps you remember you can send your lead Pokemon out with the R button. That way you can have the Pokemon that's walking with you go pick up items playing around or go battle with its own on other stuff like that. Let's go! Auto battle, cool. I'll give you the rundown, you know, auto battle. I can send my Pokemon out, it will fight on its own, I don't have to watch it, and I can just relax. I'm going to unleash God upon the world. Well, okay, let's see, we are here. Poco Path is right here, okay, so that's home, that's Nimona's house, no, that's the lighthouse, okay. And, okay, there's, uh, there's a, wait, what is that? Is that a Ralts? Okay, that's a Ralts, an Igglypuff, and a Hoppet. Grass, Psychic, and Fairy. You know what we can do, though? Because we need a type advantage. We need something strong. We need to get good. We need something that will give us an edge in all the future battles to come. So, there's only one solution I can think of. And that is to basically cheese it with the mystery gift. See, Ash, he and Red never caught Mew. They caught Mew too. Me, I have my ways. Now, let's see. We have a psychic advantage now. Now we need, I don't know, ice. So, like a flute. I mean, I don't think we can use this one soon, even as a gift because it is level 50 and we just started. So that one's probably gonna go into a box somewhere for a while. But while we're here, let's get some more stuff. It's like you knew this was going to the right hands. Thank you. In case a Pokemon of mine faints, Nintendo, you are so considerate. Man, if only I had some Pokeballs too. Well, I'm pretty much good on balls for a little bit. Now I'm a bit hungry. What kind of code do we have for food? Look at this. They gave me enough to make some sandwiches. I don't even know what a sandwich does yet. But I got some. Five bananas, five peanut butters, five butters, and red Pokeball pick. Oh, no pickles. Not from me, from my friend.
we go. We are all set for our adventure in Paldea. What will happen? What will my team finally be? I don't know. Will we keep Mew in a party or will we level them up later? We'll find out. I hope you like, comment, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. Bye.